Yeah. All right, you ready to partay? Yeah. My racing shoes. Well, now I don't have a basket, so I gotta hold on. <laughs> Holy. Oh! Oh my God! <laughs> 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 I'm like really confused. Hey! Oh, are you being so? <laughs> 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 Thanks. I mean, that's Isabel's height, and so it's like, I'll just go probably, I'll start from down here and I'll run this way, okay. and then I'll jog back down. That was, tw what, 20 miles? Yeah, that was like approximately, yeah, like, yeah, 21. 25 miles at race pace. <laughs> it's always running these dudes at race pace, and I'm like, fuck, why do they stay so fast? No, actually, that was um, 6 by 200, just at, like, race pace, or, like, kind of, like, slightly faster-ish um, on the middle part of the course here. Cool. And that's it. Now just easy running. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right.
I'll just do really weird ones in front of the hotel to like make all the other runners. Oh, Check so you in the worm. <laughs> well, what was the one in the video last night? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what is it? Is it the like where they make the music out of that? Yeah. I love those. They did Hey Ya. Uh, I'll show it to you. We got to make sure it to Matt. I swear to Oh, yeah. It's supposed to be that size. What do you say, Jim? It's hard to make the argument that that's even close to it. <laughs> <laughs> Can we like Tetris it? Like move the tail in? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do all the whole like trigonometry here? Yeah. yeah. We have some uh, purple tape. And especially if you... Yeah, oh no! Oh, John! <laughs> then I'll have tape on my face. Yeah. <laughs> Good luck. I'll, t I'll bring that back to the development team. We're, we're yeah. just like, I know there's a lot of uncertainties about tomorrow, but I can <laughs> almost... <laughs> 1,000% promise you that I will not be right now. <laughs> Thank you guys. Awesome. Thank you. Rolling? I need to find her and give her a hug. That would be... You might need those. It was good. You have good taste. I knew I liked you. See you guys. Thank you. than I expected to. What but hurts the most? Honestly, so like, I feel like this right, like knee and quad takes a lot of the pounding on it. Um, it was nice that there were like literally no hills on this course. So, or I, other than that last hill, but there's so few hills that like, I feel a lot less beat up than after like a New York or something, but definitely feeling it kind of like, it just like, gunk all through this like quad yeah i gotta get ready for this walk <laughs> the real focus of the weekend but yeah it's like all in through there you can already see it like getting red it's just been really really tight so yeah so i'll do some like over the next few days 
because I won't be running. I'll just like take the next few days off. It'll be a lot of mobility, some light scraping, and just trying to like flush out some of the marathon from my legs and then can get back into training once everything feels okay. How long do you think that'll be? Ideally, like maybe three, four days, no running, which is a little longer than I usually take, but we really want to like, just because we're going right into the trials build, I really want to make sure that I like take my downtime now because once we start going, we're, we're going like there's no turning back. And so I need to make sure that I'm actually like feeling, feeling good. And we'll be back home in Wisconsin, so I feel like I want to enjoy that time off. But yeah, maybe like four days no running, two weeks of just like very easy running, and we won't start fully marathon training again until at least November. And then how long will that build be? 12 weeks. I think that's what that is. That's a question for Jonathan Green. <laughs> but yeah, it's nice right now being able to just like know that the next few days are just going to be letting the body recover, letting the, letting all that work like marinate a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Cause I think this will have been just very good practice for the trials even. Yeah. Do you want to talk about the race? Yeah. Race was honestly everything that we needed it to be. It was like just a really like solid day out there. Um, Rory, uh, link later, my friend was pacing me. Um, and it was honestly like spot on went out, like at the pace we needed to died a little bit in the second half. So definitely going to focus on working on that strength into this trials build. But I was just really happy with how comfortable it felt. Um, running 525s just like consistently. I mean, we were even a little bit fast through the, or fast through the first half. So it's just like, I feel like that was a big confidence boost that I needed of just like, oh yeah, like this, we can run this pace. We know how to do this. Did it feel good to be racing again? Yeah, <laughs> it felt really good. It was fun getting to see you guys out on the course, see the family out on the course, and just like, honestly, I kind of, through all the like ups and downs of this last year, I'd kind of forgotten like how fun it actually is to race a marathon. Like more than anything, it was just really, really fun being back out there. Like uh, Rory and I were like talking a little bit through the race and every, like tons of people had like really fun signs and we were feeling so good. Like it's just a blast being out on a really good course and getting kind of perfect weather. It was one of those days that you really hope for. <laughs> And now we get to enjoy it and do a little hot girl walking on the lakefront or sad girl walking. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna attack. Are they different? They're just a little bit different. These are my like my older ones that are oh. slightly more comfortable. Those aren't broken in yet. Where are the comfy ones? Yeah. Well, I love that like fashionable shoes now are also comfortable dad shoes. It really, that's a positive trend for marathoners. I'm not looking for like the return of ballet flats. <laughs> Should we try and go quick while the arrow? <laughs> Izzy, what is this? <laughs> a hot girl walk. No, it's a walk of shame that morning after. A walk of shame. Always so cute. I love this. I just already made it. So you're one so happy. But pretty much we're just gonna go for shake the legs out a little bit. We're just gonna walk up a tiny bit. We'll turn around and then we'll walk um, and end at a coffee shop. So I'm very excited. You guys are all here. Um, and yeah, they can try. Thanks for coming out. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Oh my god. Yeah. You had so Fuck many that. We're not the only one walk. Yeah. Yes, we love you. Wait, it's nice to meet you.
Oh, you're 